This tutorial will give you a quick overview of the Image Pro Insight workspace. Here we see some images that we've opened. And on the left here is our image strip. There's easy ways to navigate through your images. We can either click on each individual tab, which you can see it'll activate the image that we're clicking on, or you can click on the images in the image strip on the left. Now if you're used to not having this tabbed format, there's an easy way to move back to the MDI or multiple document interface view. You just click on this button up in the top left. Now we have individual workspaces opened. You can click on it again and you'll go back to your tabbed interface. Image Pro Insight uses a tabbed menu system. This makes it easy to visually see the different tools that are available to you. And if you want to give yourself some more space in your workspace, you can just double click on that tab. And now you can see you have more workspace available. Double click again, and the tab returns. Some other ways that you can add additional room to your workspace is to use these auto hide tools or thumbtacks. So if we click on this thumbtack in the image strip, you can see now it's been tacked to the side. When we hover over it, it opens again, and then it goes away. Click on the other thumbtacks, and they've closed up as well. If you want to open them back up again, just click on that tack, and it'll be open again in your regular workspace. Image Pro Insight also includes a quick access toolbar up at the top. We've included some more frequently used tools such as the multiple document interface view to switch between docking and tab view, undos and redos, the ability to open images, print, image information, easy access to the selection tool, and a tool to close all views if you just want to easily close all of your images. Now if you want you can customize this view as well. Just click on the arrow there to the right, select more commands, and now you have all kinds of different options available for you that you can add to your quick access toolbar. The nice thing about this is these stay available wherever you are in the workspace. They're always going to be there up on top. Another nice usability tool we've added is the ability to see some quick information about your image. If you hover over the tab, you can see a, a quick thumbnail of that image. So we're moving across here and you can see some image information such as the size and uh, the type of image. Now if you also want to just close your images quickly you have some options when you right click on the tab. You can either save, you can open the folder that that uh, image is in if it's been saved to your hard drive. You can close the image, close all but this, and close all views which closes everything. Um, in this example let's say we just want to keep this first image open and close everything else. We'll choose close all but this and now just that image stays open so it allows us to quickly and easily clean up our workspace. So these are just some quick tools to show you the overall um, workspace of Image Pro Insight. There are several other tutorials that show you in more detail the different functions. We hope that these tools were useful. If you have any questions please contact your local sales office or your media cybernetics representative. Thank you.